All right, so apparently online, this thing's getting a lot of bad reviews, this hole cutter. I mean, it clearly states it's only for drywall and ceiling tiles, yet people are giving bad reviews because it, it, it explodes and falls to pieces when they try to drill a hole in wood. Well, it's not made for wood. So let's find out. I got four holes to do right now. that hole like I said before don't worry about reviews try it for yourself it looks beautiful all right I got four more number two wonderful all right, let's go to number three. Listen to those reviews. Try it out for yourself. Now I got four more to do. Well, I didn't get the drywall in yet. Got another one down here. But I gotta say, looks good. I don't know what these people are talking about. General public, general public are a problem. Especially when you allow them to review you. So yeah, I'm definitely happy with this. I even adjusted it for the ceiling fan box. Perfect. So yeah, I'm a fan of it. I don't care what people say. I'd like to be able to use it for this. This is a little too big. It only goes up to seven inches. This is like nine or 10 inches. I'll have to figure something else out for that. But yeah, I think it's worth it. Even if I only get this job out of it, 32 bucks. I mean, it's obvious nothing's made anymore to last forever. It's all made in China. So I'd be happy to spend the $32 to just finish this job and make it come out nice. So if you're buying this, expecting it to last for 20 years, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs>